Hey guys, Valeros here. Today I will be showing you an easy way to level up your characters in Ark Survival Ascended. Alright, so for this to work, you will need a few things. Um, ideally, you would want it to be a 2x event weekend um, on official, or 3x would be even better, 4x. Um, other than that, you're going to need a Thyla. And we are using the Thyla because of its bleed effect. The better the saddle that's on it, it'll benefit you more, you'll take less damage. Then we're going to need a weapon. Uh, I am going to use a crossbow because I found that it does more damage than some of the other guns that I've tried. <clears throat> but that's what you're going to use and it's cheap too other than that so this character is level 1 well it was level 1 I leveled up once since I got on the server uh, this is official an official island server and the rates right now are 1x now if I wanted to mid-max this, I would wait till the 2x weekend on official, and I would also wait for a Broth of Enlightenment, but for the tests in this video, we're not going to use it. We are going to use a 2x note and a 4x note, so I'm going to fly over to those right now. I'm going to go ahead and get two 2x two notes while I'm over here just because I can. Do I need to? No, but I can. Um, alternatively, you can use Karchar and Giga Babies to get experience. Karchar Babies, last I checked, give more experience than Giga Babies. Uh, correct me down in the comment section if I'm wrong. So the first note we're going to get is right here at 92.22. We're going to fly up and over this hill to get this 4x note on the cliff. Hop off our Rhino Ganthia and run down here and pick this up. Try not to run into the water, that would be a bad day. Get that. Now you don't have to have a Rhino Ganthia for this, to do this. Uh, a Tranodon or an RG, uh, a Wyvern would also work. Really wouldn't use a Quetzal, they're really slow. I also, I don't know if I would use an RG either. Uh, if you have a friend to help you out with this, it's going to be a lot safer than you doing it on foot. Which is why I have my second account right there loaded in. Uh, Athena, the Goddess of War. Since I don't have, well, I have friends, but none of them are on right now, so my second account gets to be my uh, helping hand, which should be interesting to do. <clears throat> Actually, I might not even use her. But we, I'm sure you guys seen it already. I'm sure you've seen what was in the background when I started the video up, so I'm sure you know what we're going to kill. But we are going to be killing a Titan. So the Thyla, whenever you use the left mouse button or its main attack, will cause a bleed on whatever it's hitting. And the bleed will deal 5% damage to that target. So it will deal 5% damage to the Titan. Um, so in order to get to 100%, 5 times 20 is 100, so we have to hit the Titan 20 times to kill it. If we kill the Titan with the bleed, unless they fixed it, we don't get experience from it. So we are going to kill, we are going to attack the Titan 19 times, and then we're going to shoot it with our crossbow. There's one, and then you want to run away. You Ideally, you don't want to get hit. Wait for the bleed to go away on the Titan. You see the bit of the bleed there. That's two. Yeah, right there. That's that's the effect that you want. 
Ideally, I wouldn't be right here doing this. I could probably go up on that cliff and get a better vantage point, but we're going to do it down here in the thick of it in the water just because I can. Why not? So that is four hits. If you have already completed the tech cave or your uh, friend has completed the tech cave, it makes this a lot easier. Because you can pull up the, uh, you can target the Titan and it'll tell you how many times you've hit it. So, you know, if its health is down halfway, obviously you need to hit it nine more times. I don't remember how many times that is. I think that's seven. Then you just keep doing this. Uh, the stats on this Thyla are that it has 47 points into health, and then after I raised it, I put uh, all of its levels into health to get it up as much health as possible. That's 12. This might take longer than I thought. Hit it. You gotta get that hit marker on it. Right, right there. 13. 14. Do not do this while you're in your base or you're near someone else's base. You don't want to wipe their base. That would be that would be a, a butthead thing to do. I can math right and guess this shouldn't kill it should theoretically and now I shoot it obviously try avoiding it the best you can you don't want to take any direct hits on your thylo that's a bad deal for you if you can get the Titan to run away that would be even better which I think it's doing now but then you're just gonna sit here and pelt it with arrows. Use uh, assault rifle, shotgun. I tried using a shotgun. Uh, I had a 298 uh, pump shotgun that I tried using on this, and my 298 crossbow was doing more damage than my 298 pump. Um, those are the only two weapons that I've really tried. I didn't have a. Uh, oh, sweet! I killed it. I didn't have a 298 sniper rifle or assault rifle to use, so I did not use those. So I have not tested them, so let me know down in the comments if they're better. Uh, or you could use a sword if you're spec'd into melee. If you, well, that's obviously for higher level characters. You're not going to be able to do that on a new character. But higher level characters can spec into melee and do that. Hey, look, there's a person. All right, let's see how many levels we got. 95 levels. We would have gotten even more if I had a Broth of Enlightenment on, and we probably would have been 105 if I would have had a Broth of Enlightenment, and this would have been a 2x event. So my character got 40 or 94 levels from this, so I should be 106 when I'm done. And as you've seen when I first started the video, it was a brand new uh, brand new character. But that is one of the easiest ways to level, or one of the easier ways to level in Arc Ascended. Um, if you use uh, like a Giga, like that guy came over here in a Giga, if you use a Giga to kill a Titan you'll only get half the experience, which is why I like using a Thyla because I can shoot from the back of it. Uh, the Thyla after I deal the bleed damage to it, which is why I like using it. 
Obviously, you can use Gigas or Car Chars if you wanted to do that instead. You will kill them faster, but you'll get less XP. Anyways, I hope you guys found the video useful. If you did, please like. If you're not subscribed to the channel, please subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one.